Having long expected Android 5.0 to be named Key Lime Pie, Google has instead handed the K release name to Android 4.4, and in a weird cross promotional deal, it's called Android Kit Kat. Android 4.3 recently arrived on the new and old Nexus 7, as well as the Nexus 4 and 10, but is yet to reach other devices. It'll also be coming soon to the HTC One and Galaxy S4 Google editions, with HTC saying it'll push it out to devs by the end of the month. Android 4.4, on the other hand, is yet to receive an official date, but we suspect an October announcement, with a November 2013 rollout is likely. A big clue to the release comes from Nestle Germany, who recently confirmed an October launch for Android KitKat via its Facebook wall. Android 4.3 comes with a handful of minor upgrades, such as better multi-user customization, support for Bluetooth smart technology, and an updated keyboard. As for what treats we can expect from Android 4.4, Google is so far keeping tight-lipped, although it has said it wants KitKat to be an amazing Android experience for everyone. From this, we can conclude that Google wants to get Android onto less powerful devices. And to back this up, Android Central reported back in February that Google is working with the Linux 3.8 kernel, which uses less RAM. Other rumors point to gallery visualization tweaks, new animation APIs, new notification widgets, and the ability to change the default Android Blue to other colors. One of the first handsets we expect to come running Android 4.4 is the long-awaited Nexus 5. The handset has been leaked several times recently, first in Google's own Android KitKat promo video, which was promptly taken down, and then again on 16th of September when it was spotted in a bar. The Nexus 5 is largely expected to arrive as a repackaged version of the LG G2. Some of the rumors we've heard point to a 5 or 5.2 inch Full HD display, quad-core Snapdragon 800 processor, and up to three gigs of RAM. If Google is planning an October launch for Android KitKat, we may well see the Nexus 5 touching down at the same time, as we expect Google will want to show its latest OS running on brand new hardware. You can stay up to date with all our Android KitKat and Nexus 5 news by subscribing to our YouTube channel. And for loads more smartphone news, be sure to head over to techradar.com.